an emulation of the 1073 legendary Neve console, right? This is uh, like the channel strip or the one channel emulation of a console where it includes uh, saturation, pretty cool saturation. You're gonna hear it in a moment. Also three band EQ with very musical curves for highs, mids and lows. Uh, you see here uh, below the knobs the shape of the EQ, right? So here the highs, uh, for the highs you have a high shelf, okay, that you boost or cut like this. Here in the mids you have a bell curve. You, if you uh, move with your mouse, this, um, let's see here. Yeah, it's, if you move, move with your mouse, mouse wheel, you're gonna see the different uh, frequency ranges, right? Uh, from uh, 360 hertz in the low mid area all the way up to 7.2 k k kilohertz sorry all right and you can turn off also that band or disable it and in the lows you have also a low shelf and if you lower your mouse uh, it's not with the mouse wheel actually it's with your with the click of the mouse you keep keep pressed the the uh, click right and so from 35 hertz and above till 220 for the lows and you have a high pass filter here all right it's off by default and you can high pass it till 300 hertz all right to use the e equalizer section you need to enable it here in this button you have a face flip here also a trim if you need to compensate any volume that the drive or saturation introduces and you have also oversampling up to 32x very cool to avoid aliasing and digital distortion especially in higher frequencies all right so let's check it out this uh, cool eq on these drums first <laughs> Let's add some saturation. Frame a bit. Before. Before. After. All right, pretty cool saturation right there. And let's add some highs. All right. Let's cut some lows here. 360 All right let's boost with a low shelf at around 60 hertz for the drums some cool fatness just to check the high pass filter All right Right, so that's the EQ 1979 on drums. Let's check it out also. The school EQ here on these guitars. I love to add saturation to distorted guitars. We need to trim a bit. Cool extra texture to the guitars, some highs. Before. 
very musical highs. And let's remove some low end rumble with this. Check out the mids. Pretty cool, super, super musical EQ.